Hi, I want to talk about something I read today and just a sec, I'll look it up and it's about smart goals, smart goals in Google Analytics and I really hate the fact that um, first of all I really like Google Analytics it's a magnificent tool I really like Tag Manager it's insane what you can do with these things but um, just a sec so Google Analytics introduced smart goals recently and smart goals is um, let me just read it to you Smart goals are configured at the view level. Smart goals use machine learning, which is very interesting, to examine dozens of signals about your website visits to determine which of those are most likely to result in a conversion. So far, so good. So, sounds really interesting. Each visit is assigned as a score with the best visits being translated into smart goals so visits are being translated in goals and that's where it goes wrong some examples of those signals include the smart goals model are session duration page per session location device and browser remarketing smart lists use a similar machine learning model to identify and identify your best users so what I like about remarketing smart list, it does identify the best users and makes a list out of it. And that's separately, and it makes a list that you can use in AdWords. What I don't like about smart goals is it, that it counts visits as a goal. So you have to set up a goal in analytics for visits. A goal is still, for me, a conversion. It's a transaction, it's a lead, it's a contact form, it's maybe clicking a button, filling your form, I don't know, but not a visit. A visit is just the beginning of a conversion and that shouldn't be a goal. That's wrong. If it's a visit and you're making a group, for me it's a segment, it's the most logical thing. If you segment, you can find those people you want to target. It's the same with the CRM system. If you make segments, you make a bucket of people and you work with that bucket. You don't make it a goal. It's not a goal, Google, it's not a goal. It's just... You know how hard it is to tell clients that they don't want to put in visits as a goal it's more than visits it's more than traffic it's about conversion it's about making money it's about offering the best product and making transactions it's not about visits visits are segmentation so far my little rant for smart goals so i'm not going to use it anytime soon i really don't like it i really like the idea behind it because it's, it's using all kinds of machine learning things or algorithms. It's actually machine learning, it's not algorithms. Machine learning to, to check out uh, the best visits, the top five of the traffic to your site coming from AdWords. Once that threshold is set, Smart Goals applies to all your website visits, including traffic from channels other than AdWords. After enabling Smart Goals in Google Analytics, they can be imported into AdWords. So I don't like them as a goal. Why are they using goals? Very simple. It's the only thing you can import into AdWords to check if you're getting conversions. So the link with analytics is there with the goal they have no they have no separate framework for tagging other stuff and that's the problem that's why they i think that's why they put the visits in a goal because so they can drag it into adwords so i'm not a fan i'm not going to use it anytime soon and i think they should uh turn it into a list like a remarketing list and all the smart goal. I think it's a very stupid thing to do, but that's my two cents. That's it.